Travesties is an extraordinary play and Pitt Lockery is rather lucky to get hold of it at the moment because it's just about to open on Broadway with Tom Hollander playing the lead role of Henry Carr. Um, Stoppard talked about ambushing the audience and I think we try and do that from the very start of our production. If you come and see it, you'll see what I mean. Um, we hope to surprise you all the times with things that are happening that you're not quite expecting. And characters turn out to be rather different than we've thought they are. The butler Bennett turns out to be someone who might, who might, be, a, might be a Russian spy, for example. But we've got this box of tricks, really, a farce. There's a whole scene that's played out as a musical number. It's the tea scene from the importance of being earnest. And the two girls, who are currently in our production of Chicago as well, um, do a song and dance number to this tea scene from the importance of being earnest. Uh, that comes out of a very moving scene where Lenin has talked about his, um, how moved he is by listening to Beethoven, but realises he can't afford to be moved by art because it will stop him being able to commit violence to people. So the play does these extraordinary jumps and juxtapositions of tone and meaning and constantly pulls the rug out from underneath you. There are big philosophical arguments in the play um, about the importance of art, and um, Stoppard wants to discuss this, but they're always couched in a rather comic scene. So you can enjoy it on several levels. You can enjoy it because, yes, the content of that speech is very interesting and profound, um, and maybe something you hadn't thought about, but the context of the scene is generally humorous and silly. Um, so it's, it's sort of sugar-coated quite often. It's hugely funny and entertaining and involves hundreds of theatrical styles, musicals, striptease, limericks, monologues all sorts of things, um, and is an extraordinary concoction, and rarely the like of which you'd see again if you come and see it.